Hey, what's going on, people? This is our Detention with a quick update video. Um, for those of you who have been following my videos, especially the TMNT rant rave reviews, I thank you. Um, and, you know, for 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 watching the videos, for liking, for commenting, for disliking, whatever. Uh, thank you so much for your you know for your support. And I will be back for the next you know for the next season starting next month, October twelfth at eleven a.m. Um, <clears throat> my only problem with it so far is uh, after hearing the after originally hearing the announcement uh, um, a while back is the fact that it's going to be on the 11 a.m. time slot. Now the only time I I know it's a you know it's a Saturday morning cartoon. Give me a break here, but you know I, I'm I'm at work during that time, so I can't you know watch the you know watch the episodes and, and as they premiere and then review them. After that, I I have to, you know, put it on my DVR, make sure my DVR is set, and then I gotta watch them when I get, you know, when I get home. If I'm not doing anything, at, you know, afterwards, and and that that that's my only real pet peeve about the you know about the time slot. I mean, hey, what are you gonna do anyway? Um, here are two things that I want to see for this next season. First off, Casey Jones is going to be introduced in this new season, if you don't already know. And I saw people, when, after the announcement was made and after the picture was, was revealed of what he was going to look like, people were complaining about the way he looks. They were saying, why does he look like a punk? Why, you know, why does he look like a teenage punk? Why is he da 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 I'm like, okay, he's aged down because, obviously, they have to have him and April hook up. That's just been a staple in every, car in, in, in every incarnation of the Turtles, except for Next Mutation, where April didn't even show up. Um, you know, they're supposed to be an item, and think of it this way, just like we saw April develop as a, you know, as a character while she was aged down, and she had much of a, much more of a, of a, um, of a stake in this, in this entire, in, in this entire series, more than she has in other incarnations, is the fact that, you know, she's a, you know, she's a, you know, she's a teenager. We got to see her, you know, we got to see her grow, we got to see, we got to know more about, you know, about family, like her father and all that, and, you know, and eventually she probably will become a reporter or something uh, down the line. So the same thing with, you know, with Casey Jones. He's already got that vigilante, uh, that vigilante vibe about him, and he's, you know, and he's a, you know, and he's a young kid, and we know that he's going to become the Casey Jones that we all know, it's just you know, you're just going to have to give him a chance to grow, you know what I'm saying, in any other incarnation, uh, except for Next Mutation, where he didn't show up either, um, uh, he was already him, he was already Casey, there was no reason for him to, you know, to grow into one, he was just already, he was already Casey, and uh, in, the co in the comics, in the current comics, he was a college kid who, um, was getting roughed up by his dad, and that's how he met, you know, and that's how he met Raph. Raph broke into his house to help him out, and that's how they became friends. In the original, in the original movie, they became friends after first having, you know, having a little beef with each other after, um, you know, after Raphael stopped him from busting the, you know, from busting these two per perps. He interrupted them. You know, that's, that's, that whole thing. In the 2000 series, um, we meet him right away because of his, um, his uh, vendetta with the purple dragons, and I don't know how exactly we meet him in the 1987 series. Can someone, if anybody knows, um, when did he first show up in the original series? Comment below, please let me know, because that's one piece of info I don't know. Um, <clears throat> and uh, number two, another thing I want to, uh, another thing I really want to, I really want to see for this next season, I know there's going to be a slew of mutants, and we're going to have a lot of backstory for some, you know, for a good portion of those mutants, hopefully, and there's going to be a lot, to, you know, a lot to deal with, because it's already confirmed that this is going to be another 26 episodes, and we're already, can, and we're already guaranteed a season three, but I want to see this, um, you know, this whole storyline that's around April and the Krang, finally wrap up. I want to see what they are trying to do with April. I mean, they already said in the, uh, at the end of season one that she has, like, you know, 
you know, her, she has these powers or these brainwave patterns and something that they, you know, something that they need her for, but they didn't exactly go into detail. They were very vague about it. So I really want to see what, um, what they got in store, uh, with April and the Krang. So, uh, that's pretty, you know, that's pretty much it. Reviews will be, you know, will be coming when the, ne you know, when the next, uh, season actually starts, which is October 12th. Um, I'm going to be setting my DVR and just getting ready to nerd out on some crazy TMNT action. So, um, once again, thank you everyone who has subscribed to my channel. Thanks to these videos. Uh, thank you uh, for everyone that's been following um, the uh, the uh, rant rave reviews. And thank and thank you so much for just commenting, rating, and all that other good stuff. Um, so I will see you on the next video, and I will see you when the season starts. Peace. Love and never be normal.